The overall goal of this procedure is to identify plant metabolites that are antimicrobial to anaerobic bacteria. This is accomplished by first separating a plant extract by thin layer chromatography, or TLC. Next, the chromatogram is cut into zones comprising one or more compounds. The zones are then placed on agar inoculated with anaerobic bacteria and incubated. Following the incubation, the zones are removed and the plates are stained to identify compounds that inhibit bacterial growth. The resulting data reveal the presence or absence of antimicrobial plant metabolites. This method can help answer key questions in the field of ruminant nutrition, such as what are the effects of plant secondary metabolites on uh, nutrient utilization by specific microorganisms. Though this method reveals plant compounds that are inhibitory to rumen bacteria, it can also be applied to revealing compounds inhibitory to other bacteria or fungi. In this protocol, phenolic compounds from red clover will be used to demonstrate the identification of antimicrobial compounds by contact bioautography. Start by cleaning the thin layer chromatography, or TLC, plates. Working in a fume hood, prepare enough cleaning solvent to cover the bottom of the TLC developing chamber, as well as the lower edge of a TLC plate when set inside the chamber. Here, ethyl acetate methanol 2 to 1 is prepared. Next, wearing gloves and working in a fume hood.